guys, this is Jonathan Bowen with Hub Edge Realty, and we're here with John Stagnoni of the Friends of the State Theater here in uh, Stoughton Center. And I am a new resident of Stoughton, I've just moved here in January, so I don't know much about this, but I know that this would be a huge asset to the town of Stoughton and the surrounding communities. So when I heard about this, they're doing a gala here shortly, and John's going to tell us about that. Um, the restoration of this theater is, would be huge, in my opinion, for all homeowners in Stoughton, and it would be a regional center, in my opinion, that people from surrounding towns would come to, to see some live theater, and it would be a meeting spot for the community. So let's talk to John, and John, who are you? And I got this list, everybody, I'm no professional person here, so who are you and where are you from? Uh, I'm John Signoni, as you said, um, I'm from Stoughton, and I'm on the board of directors for the Friends of the State Theater, uh, one of uh, seven, and um, we've been working on re the restoration of the theater. Uh, part of it, we bought the original blueprints, and it's, uh, we're looking to bring it back to where it was in 1927 when the building opened. Why did you get involved with the State Theater? Uh, I've been involved in a lot of town activities and committees and boards, and um, this is just one of the things that given back to the community. Okay, all right, I like that answer. Uh, what, what, tell me about the State Theater's history, what is, what has been going on here since it was built? Uh, well, the State Theater's evolved, it, as I mentioned, it uh, opened in 1927 as, as a vaudeville theater as, back in the era. Um, this was what was known as, as an atmospheric theater, which uh, for people that don't know, it's uh, the ceiling is painted blue and there's cloud stars projected above and things and there's a lot of trees and things. So it gives you the atmosphere that you're outdoors but indoors. Um, you know, so we, our goal is to restore it back to that and make this a destination place for the, uh, the, the region. So you told me it's about 650 seats combining the downstairs and the upstairs and you are hoping to get about that many seats after the restoration is complete? Yeah, we should be still able to keep around there. We're also looking to uh, put some VIP tables down front and we're trying to make the uh, theater so that we can do multiple things during the day. A is business like, could use it, you know. Uh, is this like it. Gillette Stadium? We're going to do some uh, corporate boxes. Is that what we're doing? Uh, no, <laughs> no corporate boxes, but it's, you know, if somebody wants to purchase some, maybe we could get that in. Um, what is your, tell me about the future. What's your vision? What would you really like to see here? What are your options? Uh, well, ultimately, the goal is, like I said, is to do a, a full restoration back to where it was in 1927. We have some artist render, renderings, which if you go to our website, uh, statetheater.us, you'll find uh, the renderings on there. And, you know, that's the ultimate goal. But if worst case scenario, we, we're going to start looking at, you know, what are our options and what are the minimum things we need to do? How can we get to some shows going and then get people excited about it? Because right. it's a... It's a really great building. It's got some good bones, and uh, there's a lot of good people working behind it, uh, volunteers working to get this done. How does this fit into the revitalize, hopeful revitalization of Stoughton Center, which in my opinion right now, is, it need, I, I'll be honest, it needs a lot of work. There's a lot of things here that I drive by here every day, and I look at these storefronts and I say this could be better. How does this fit in with the overall restoration? Actually, the, the Town of Stone just did a master plan yep. and the theater is one of the key pieces to the master plan and making this downtown to be a success. Um, so yeah, it fits in as a major part of this. And the town here actually supports this. Uh, they've uh, pledged uh, $500,000 to the project already. Oh, wow. Town meetings that. approved that. That's so, great. So the town's behind it, the state, we've been having money from in the state budget through our state representatives and senator. They've been very supportive. Um, so and we're hopefully gonna set up a meeting with our congressman pretty soon. Great. Um, um, sorry, let me add on to that. Stoughton Station, another part of the revitalization. Uh, the library, another part of the revitalization. Those are three big keys for the downtown Stoughton area. Absolutely. Uh, the town has been very proactive in the last few years and spent a lot of money investing itself besides the master plan uh, with other planning and uh, the redevelopment authority in town has been, uh, did a study on the downtown and yeah. specific, coming up with a specific plan for the revitalization of the downtown. So we're also talking, hopefully, uh, we've had some preliminary talks with the moving the post office 
and redeveloping that site oh, cool. and making a big park or something. Great, great, yeah. great. Um, we want money, right? Friends yeah. of Stone Theater wants money, right? What are yeah. you folks doing to get some of that? I see there's some big dona uh, do uh, donations on your website. Um, Carlos Vargas and Vargas and Vargas Insurance. There are some big businesses that are helping. Who are some of the businesses that have helped and who who do you want to help in the future? Who do you want to, who, you want everybody, I know, but. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's, a, you know, it's a grassroots thing. There's, uh, there is naming rights available to the, for the, uh, to, as a performing arts center, okay. you know, at the State Theater. Okay. Uh, the stage, the auditorium, all these things have naming rights that oh. we, you know, are possible for a corporation. Yeah. Um, Ikea was one of the first ones who pledged uh, $25,000 right. early on. Uh, I love so. Ikea, by the way. Yeah. I have so, an Ikea kitchen. I love and Ikea, yeah. Yeah, so, and you mentioned Vargas and Vargas. Carlos has been uh, fantastic. He was, you know, he was another first corporation. And I don't want to leave anybody out. We sure, of course not, of course not. Basically, you know, so. people can go on your website and they can see the list of uh, people, uh, people and corporations who have, so far, donated to the restoration. Yeah, there's a lot of individuals and companies, and um, like I said, it's going to take many to, to make it happen. Right, right, right. Um, you and I just spoke off camera. I would love to see somebody out there who has the ability or knows of a website or a company that would allow for continuous weekly or monthly donations to the Friends of State Theater. Maybe it's somebody uh, gives $10 a week or maybe it's $100 a month. I think for the State Theater, if they knew that they were having a revenue stream I think that could be very important in uh, moving this forward. Yeah, it, obviously, if you, if you could get <laughs> a, 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 a pledge, you know, for so much per month or whatever, sure. like a lot of organizations do, yeah. it, it could help us maybe go get a loan to, yeah, to move course. some of the things Yeah, $10,000 a month, $20,000 a month, $500 a month, mm, anything. $10 a month. Even, yeah, well, what I'm saying, people, yeah, what I'm whatever saying whatever if you could, if everybody could pile that together, yeah. and now you're bringing in $20,000 a month, that would be fantastic. Every little, every little bit helps. Absolutely. Okay, great. So here we go. So tell us about this gala. I actually have a check for you, a hundred dollar check for the gala that's coming up. Tell us about that. Yeah, the gala is um, it's a raffle fundraiser, but um, it, we're also going to have live entertainment, some um, appetizers or whatever for folks at Cash Bar. Um, so it's a, it's to raise some money for for the, the restoration and some programming. Uh, we did start a, another uh, company under the Friends of the State Theater, which is State of the Arts, and we're looking to start doing some productions and things. Uh, so I'm tell me a little job. bit. I don't know anything about that. Please tell me about that. I don't know. <laughs> uh, it was just what, you know, we were looking to, like I said, to start doing productions. And, and off-site. We it would be off-site. Ah, okay. And build, kind of brand the business, build the business. And That's things. interesting. That's um, great, yeah. You know, and again, it's to get people to know us and see what we're looking to do because we're not, you know, we're looking to do community theater as well, but we're looking to do Broadway-type sure. performance and professional theater. Sure, uh, sure. So, you know, we're really looking to make this a, a higher end, like we said, a destination for folks to come to. So my girlfriend's sister is a booking agent on Broadway and she's actually gonna be here next weekend. And this may be a little bit too small for her, but I can get her, you know, started to maybe think about this little stoking. She's actually opening up her own company and maybe start thinking about this little theater in the future, maybe book it, you know? Um, all right, so a uh, few things. I have a check here for $100 for the uh, gala, so my girlfriend and I will be there. Sounds good. And for Thank Hub you. Edge Realty, we're gonna give you 500 bucks today, and I know it's not a lot of money, okay? But it's probably a doorknob, but hopefully when this is finished, I look at a doorknob and I said, I helped to build this place. So I, I am glad, it very no, much, I am glad, to, uh, glad to give to local uh, nonprofits. This would be a giant boon to the town of Stoughton. I promise you as a real estate broker, this would increase your property values. If you're a homeowner in Stoughton and you want to increase your property values, please give to the friends of the State Theater. I promise you that it will pay dividends down the road. Okay? All right. Thank, Thank you, sir. You Thanks, John. All right. Cheers.